The overall goal of this procedure is to achieve the highest possible resolution imaging in liquid with a commercial AFM operated in amplitude modulation, also known as tapping mode. This method helps pushing the limit of standard AFM operation in liquid by using the best combination of parameters for high resolution. The main advantage of this technique is that it can be used with most commercial AFMs and as such it doesn't require any specialist equipment. The method presented here is aimed at scientists and technicians who already have some basic knowledge of AFM but would like to get more out of the technique. This method is not aimed at any particular type of sample and can be broadly applied to study of samples from physics, biology, chemistry, materials and surface sciences. Generally, individuals new to this technique will struggle because it requires some patience to find the best parameters for a given sample. Bath sonicate the instruments and the disc supporting the substrate in ultra-pure water, followed by isopropanol and again ultra-pure water, each for 10 minutes. When aiming for high resolution, any contamination can have detrimental consequences. Wear gloves at all times and ensure that any surfaces or instruments that come in contact with the sample, cantilever or AFM cell are thoroughly cleaned. After sonication, dry each of the instruments and the sample disc under a flow of nitrogen. Use a steel disc as the support for mica to image single adsorbed metal ions. Physically clean the surfaces that can't be cleaned by sonication by wiping them with single ply low lint tissues soaked in ultra pure water, isopropanol, and ultra pure water sequentially. Allow the surface to dry in air for up to 30 minutes. Next, prepare a small amount of epoxy glue by thoroughly mixing the reagent.